Boy, it is a bitterly cold day out there. We haven't warmed up much from where we started. We started in the upper teens, and we're only making it to the lower mid-20s so far. It's 23 in Lima, 25 in Columbus, and colder the further north you go, 19 in Grand Rapids, 22 right now in Indianapolis. So with a light breeze, not a lot of wind out there today, but it still does feel like the upper teens. So just make sure you dress in layers today and just know we're not going to warm up much more as we go throughout the afternoon. We also have a lot of clouds in place, too. And that's part of why we're not seeing temperatures warm up too much. You know, if we had sunshine in 20s, it wouldn't be too bad. But with the clouds, it just, it's a really cold day. Not much to warm us up. You look off to the west here, we've had some very light snow near the Quad Cities here. And we're parts of uh, western Illinois, parts of Missouri as well. But a lot of this is just uh, Virga that we call it here. I've been looking at the observations out to the west and not seeing a lot of ground troop through any snow uh, actually making it to the ground. And that's key for us tonight because the air is so dry. <clears throat> excuse me, very dry, that a lot of that snow that falls is going to be falling aloft, and by the time it makes it to the ground, it basically just sublimates, and we end up with hardly anything. So that we're thinking tonight just a few flurries, and overall not much of any concern when it comes to snowfall. So temperatures, let's talk about that here. We have a slight warming trend on the way starting tomorrow. We're back above freezing, so today is the only day below freezing. And from here on, we're going up here with the temperatures, going all the way to Friday night, early Saturday. Look at this surge of warm air. I mean, this is not typical for December. We're looking at temperatures Friday night, early Saturday, possibly working their way into the low 60s. The record high Saturday is 63, and we are forecasting 63 degrees, believe it or not, uh, for Saturday morning. So quite the weather whiplash uh, coming our way. Some big changes over the next several days. And again, let's first off talk about the snowfall chance that we've been talking about here. Again, it look, looks like for our area, we're going to stay fairly dry. There will be a band of light snow around Cincinnati to Dayton to Columbus. Those areas could actually see some spots getting a half inch or so of snow, but all indications are that it will stay south of our area. So a few flurries could fly tonight, but we're not forecasting for now any accumulation. And then tomorrow we're quiet, mostly cloudy. And temperatures will start to warm up just a bit here. And our next chance of any precipitation will start to work in late Thursday. We'll have a weak front come in. This could start as possibly a little mix, but temperatures going to be warming up here. Really just looking at a few showers late Thursday. And that'll just kind of be a tease on what's coming our way heading towards Friday and into the weekend. So your seven-day forecast, let's talk about all the changes. This is not a boring forecast. I know the short term is kind of boring, but it gets very interesting here later this week because we go back to the 40s by Thursday. And look at the low Thursday night, 40. Friday, 60. The low Friday night, 55 degrees and 63 for Saturday. But that's in the morning, so it's a little deceiving because Saturday the temperatures fall with the cold front. We see showers Friday evening through early Saturday, and then the showers taper cooler on Sunday. But we do dry and warm back up, it looks like, as we head into next week.